morning friends welcome back to your favorite channel codeman digest today in this video we will learn about branch design pattern for microservices i'll explain the design pattern with the real world examples later we'll understand the use cases and benefit of this design pattern friends in the previous video we discussed about chain microservice design pattern can you explain what is chain microservice design pattern and where to use it please provide your answer in the comment section of this video and if you have not seen that video, so please go and watch that video. The link is provided on your screen and also in the description section of this video. So for more information, go and watch the previous video on Code One Digest channel. We have an agenda here, Daniel. It's really very simple. Friends, so here is the agenda of this video. I'll give you introduction of branch design pattern. Then I'll tell you and show you the real world example of branch design pattern for microservice. Then we'll understand the use cases of branch design pattern for the microservices. Then I'll also discuss the benefits of branch design pattern in our project. Then I'll summarize what we learned in this video and we'll also touch upon what is going to cover in the next video. So it is going to be a lot of learning and exciting. So do watch this video till end. Friends, before we proceed in this video, I request you to subscribe this channel to grow code one digest family friends i am creating a lot of quality videos on programming coding concepts design pattern and design principles cloud and container technologies but i'm not getting subscribers i request you to like share and subscribe this channel so that i can grow a code one digest family thank you Okay friends, so now let's start with the branch design pattern. This is a sixth design pattern integration design pattern category. Branch microservice pattern is the extended version of aggregator pattern and chain pattern. In this design pattern, the client can directly communicate with the service. Also, one service can communicate with more than one service at the same time. Branch microservice design pattern in which you can simultaneously process the request and response from two or more independent microservices. The main difference between the chain pattern and branch pattern is the calling of different microservice chain. So unlike the chain design pattern, the request is not passed into a sequence, but request is passed to two or more mutual exclusive microservices chain. This design pattern extends the aggregator design pattern and provides the flexibility to produce responses from multiple chains or single chain. What the hell are you talking about? Okay, friends, so now let's understand this design pattern with a real world example. Let's take an example of e commerce application. Then you may need to retrieve data from multiple sources and this data could be a collaborated output of data from various services so you can use the branch pattern to retrieve data from multiple sources or services really I... okay friends so now let's see another example of this design pattern the branch pattern work as an extension of aggregator pattern and can call different service chain in parallel in the branch pattern implementation example, service A is called by the client and can act as an aggregator, calling service chain to compose the response. Alternatively, based on the request, a specific service chain is called, thereby acting as a proxy pattern. What? I can, I, I do, I do not understand. Okay friends, so now let's see where to use this design pattern. What are the use cases and scenarios where this pattern can be applicable and useful? So use this pattern whenever one service need output of another service as a dependency and client can call any service. Use this pattern to make parallel calls to the multiple services or chained services. You're goddamn right. Friends, now let's see some of the advantages of this design pattern. What benefits we get using this design pattern. This pattern avoids tight coupling between the center of the request to the multiple services. 
This pattern simplifies the request and response for the client to make call to one or more services to get a response. Using this pattern, it is easy to add a new microservice in a chain if required in future. Wow! That's amazing! Okay friends, so now let me summarize what we learned in this video. I gave you introduction of branch design pattern. Then we saw a real world example of branch design pattern. Then I explain you what is the usage of branch design pattern in which scenario we can use the branch design pattern. Then we understood the benefits of branch design pattern. So friends, let me know if you have already used this design pattern in your project or seen a scenario where this pattern can be useful. Please provide your answer in the comment section of this video. Sounds good man, sounds good, good plan, good talk, all right? Friends, in the next video, I will cover client-side UI composition design pattern. I'll explain you what is client-side UI composition design pattern. We will learn this design pattern with the real-world example. Then, we'll understand the use cases of client-side UI composition design pattern. We will see real-world example of client-side UI composition design pattern. We will see the benefits of client-side UI composition design pattern. So stay tuned for the next video and keep watching for One Digest channel. <laughs> yes, that's amazing. <laughs> if you are new to the channel, so please do subscribe to our channel to grow our Code One Digest family. Friends, if you like this video, so give it a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel for the more interesting videos. Click on the bell icon for the latest video notifications and do not forget to share this video with all your friends and colleagues. This is very useful information for students, beginners and software engineers. I am putting a lot of efforts in creating this contents. So please help me growing the Code One Digest family. Please subscribe to Code One Digest channel for the latest programming and technology related videos. Thank you.